We jump into a litter of spots here. Lot 17 and lot 18. Lot 17 would be the little one, and lot 18 would be the big one. 28-1 uh, and 28-2. Pedigree, white lines, no words, loud mouth. That sow would have come from the heart of Sloan's uh, sow or uh, sow herd there. We bought her as a baby. Um, and as you can see, uh, some of the stuff that uh, uh, we like to build in Spotted Hogs is, is sitting in this particular litter. Uh, they were real popular on our last sale, and uh, we've got two litters to offer here. Uh, white Lines uh, would be the door hog that Beck would have bought for 35000 there. Uh, he would be a white claw, I think, uh, on the litter mate to the Reserve Grand Overall Barra there at Expo uh, that Lindsay would have shown. Uh, I saw that hog his whole stage of his life um, and uh, was really, real happy with uh, kind of how he progressed and everything like that. So I saw him, Levi saw him. We both really, really liked him and uh, tied into him on this no words loud mouth sow. Yeah, well, the spots have got a lot to live up to this time for the the uh, how, how they were here in the last sale a few weeks ago. But uh, these are, are definitely sure rivaling that that kind of quality. I mean, uh, the, the Dash 1, even though she's maybe not just wanting to hook up and just roll, I mean, I think – she might be a little pounds lighter than the other gilt, but she's not lacking from a quality standpoint. In fact, I, I like this thing pretty good if she'll just kind of get after it and go. I mean, her, uh, I mean, she, yeah, she's going to be a little more moderate, uh, but I mean, this is a either a breeding gilt or a barrel maker, in my opinion. I mean, one way or another, she's a very, very good show gilt. Um, you know, uh, dense in terms of her makeup and round bodied, good in her lines and her squareness. Um, I think just a very, very good show pig. Uh, the, the Dash 2 hits me as more of the, the brood, brood sow or, or breeding gilt perspective, if you will. Um, I mean, that thing's got a, a little bigger ear on her, but, she, man, she's got big limbs to go along with it. I mean, usually that comes kind of hand in hand. And when she gets hooked up and everything kind of comes into proportion and balance there, I think uh, that's a, a very good big ring kind of a gilt uh, that looks like her best days are out in front of her. Yeah, I mean, uh, we like these spotted hogs really well, and I'll be honest with you, they propped up and, and, and photoed and represented uh, what they are very, very well uh, there the other night uh, when we were photoing. Uh, but uh, this Dash 1, she doesn't want to exactly hook up, and maybe she will here just a little bit. Um, but uh, I think that one is a show pig deluxe, in my opinion, sharp in terms of her head, fat in terms of her arm. Uh, the feature on these things is very, very good, in my opinion. And at the same time, I think they check all the boxes. You like a hairy one. Uh, that one and a lot of them in this particular litter are very hairy and, and very dense in terms of their hair coat. You see her prop up there from the side, and I think uh, that one proportions extremely nice the dash two guilt is uh you know maybe the pounds heavy guilt but i don't think she's off quality by any stretch of the imagination still got a very good look out in front of her shoulder uh, and again her proportions are very good she reads just as big and just as dense in terms of her front arm and rear ankle size uh, and i think that one as she pulls her head and gives she flattens out and everything kind of comes into perspective uh, and you darn sure see her quality so uh, i think a, a very very good pair different in, in terms of a little bit in terms of their kind, but still both very, very good in terms of their quality. Again, uh, lot 17 will be the little gilt there in the center of the ring, and uh, lot 18 will be the big one directly under the camera.